C'est les échos du hip hop Que t'entendront tes face à l'antipop Même s'ils sont pratiqués Graffeur, beatbox, breaker, DJ, béton, picole Les potes et on y est C'est les échos du hip hop Que t'entendront tes face à l'antipop Même s'ils sont pratiqués Graffeur, beatbox, breaker, DJ, béton, picole Les potes et on y est Just your ordinary MC okay. Like you know music is what I do and breathe Anybody but the stage, fun to the tape Cause these lyrics are my love and I don't take them lightly Um, honestly, it started from MySpace When MySpace was popular Oh yeah um, So like, I was networking with a lot of people Like More Sounds, uh, Def Switch and Toon Curtis They're both from Paris uh, Broken Fingers, he's from Hungary We've been networking since I was like 16 And this is all online So when MySpace kept cracking, like when they had the playlist and everything, so uh, that's how it started, just mainly social networking. And also too, um, I mean, no offense, I love LA, you know, but I mean like, I just like the sounds from the producers out here in Europe, so that's just pretty much how it happened. Thank God for social networking. <laughs> What's good? I be gambling, caught your ass signing, so I'm just asking, what the fuck you looking at? Is it a chess or the LA cap? Oh, you want my number? Sorry, dude, I got a man. Well, Organized Set isn't a label. It's more like of a, a crew of a, a movement, and Broken Complex is a, is a label. All right. So, I mean, but at the same time, like, you know, I'm not owned by anybody, so I can do what I want. I'm yeah, a freelancer. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm not good at bitch with the crooked teeth still spitting smooth. Lord Ron, drop the beat and that magic groove. Don't gotta bend backwards to prove I could rip the mic. Cause when I do, you feel my style right. It's going great. Um, I've been really, I've been really fortunate. A lot of people have been buying it. And, you know, uh, sales are skyrocketing. Um, and you know, it's cool to go on tour. And like, this is my second time going on tour. So it's cool to like come out and perform and see all the people know my songs, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's been going really good. I can't complain. Yeah, yeah, sure. And so when you're touring, you're touring with Digital Plates, yeah? Yes. yes. The first tour was with Poetic Death, the second one was with Digital Plates. All right, so you, would you have any official DJ for... Yeah, this is my official yeah. DJ. So <laughs> he's yeah, been I'm... DJing for me since I was 16. Yes. Yeah, all right. Since... He's like my brother. He's known me since I was like yeah, 12. Since, <laughs> yeah, since she was a, a little... I've... I've uh, Since she first started rapping, I've been DJing for her. Um, I've continuous, as you see, I'm still DJing for her. Yeah. And, uh, you know, um, she's working on her new album. I've been working on the production for her new album. Um, and basically just trying to keep the tours going, keep the, the live, like, 90s, like the MC with the DJ and the whole reaction with, you know, keeping, keeping the crowd bouncing and having a DJ there to, you know, back her up and make her look and sound better as she should because she's an amazing artist and she definitely deserves those props and to stand out like that with, and it's an honor for me to be behind her and uh, pushing her forward to make her look even better than she already is, so. It's, it's definitely an honor and you know we've been longtime friends I've yeah. known her was forever so it's I'm glad to see it's it's really really coming along a lot so I'm happy about that yeah. In the pit of my stomach, a piece of me is disgusted I love it when dudes doubt when I say I can bust something But when I release, I get props and how I speak So freely, face the struggles, made me lose a feeling of cold I mean, um, I do listen to hip-hop I mean, I, I mean, I had listened to my share of hip-hop, but not every day All Not right. every day. I listen to a bit of everything. I listen to house music, listen to Amy Winehouse, you know, I listen to Arctic Monkeys or Incubus or, you know, Bjork, everything. <laughs> Even right now, we're up in the room, we're listening to like 70s soul music yeah, before exactly. we came downstairs. You know? We were yeah. listening to like the Blackbirds, like yeah. Rock Creek Park and stuff yeah. like that, like upstairs right now before we even came mm -hmm. down. So, Especially like, you know, like we're about to do a hip hop show. We're gonna keep doing hip hop shows, you know <laughs> yeah. what I mean? So. And so it's just like sometimes we just gotta listen to something different yeah. before we perform rather than just like hip hop every day, every day, you know what I mean? I love hip hop. I mean, I still listen to hip hop, you know, but sometimes I need to give it a break. Being the fact that I do rap, you know? <laughs> it, it, it leaves so. you with a fresh ear. Yeah, exactly. You know? Let me make my move. Never yeah, fox got the crown and check. Don't be surprised if you break your neck. Let me make my move. Scar City, broken fingers. Yeah, let us make our move. Yeah, um, I mean, yeah, you, you're totally right. I, um, I mean, the MCs I listen to, I listen to Kendrick Lamar a lot. Uh, 
I listen to uh, Trinidad James. Um, I listen to Three Six Mafia. <laughs> you know what I mean? Listen to everything. Um, but I mean, I definitely like. I, I mean, I like Golden Era hip hop. You know what I mean? Like I still listen to it. You know what I mean? Like I'm a big Helter Skelter fan. You know, all that good stuff. But sometimes, like the new school. You gotta love it, you know? Yeah, I like yeah. it. Not the stupid songs, but you know, the good, <laughs> the good songs with good beats and that have, you know, good vibes, you know what I mean? So, yeah. So much going on in my mind. That's why I get high just to survive all day. Just to survive. Just to survive. Um, beat makers, I love to work. I love to work with Pounds Casino. Um, um, the guy that's produced for ASAP Rocky. Um, I'd love to work with Primo. I love to work with Kanye West. I love to work with Pete Rock. Um, and uh, who else is someone else? Blue Sky Black Death. Yeah. <laughs> Blue Sky Black Death is also Blue really Sky dope, Black too. Death is really good. Really and, dope producers from yeah. the States. And um, the list goes on. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. Well, it's on the video now. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hopefully. Give me a call. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 But you get the fuck out of here. Give me some money. And uh, give me some money too while you're ready. Come on. Um, what is next is actually I'm working on my second album. And um, it's going to be really different. Since from the art, um, I when I released that, um, I was already done like three years prior. You know, it was just I didn't have the money or anything, so I couldn't release it. So, so um, I'm working on my second album, which is called Modest Confidence. And it's going to be... Uh, really personal and you know I, I know a lot of people ask like about me because it's not too much out there about me so uh, it's going to be about my life what I'm going through old relationship you know my fans the impact I've been making so it's going to be really personal and really different the flow is going to be different it's still going to be hip hop but um, it's going to be a whole nother side of me people haven't seen it I think they'll like it you let it so fire, let me know. Uh, it's that type of shit that keeps my grip tighter when I'm about to let go. Yeah, yeah, we still, yeah, we're still, we, we're trying to keep it, you know, even though we're, the relevance of new hip hop is still there and she's a very new artist, especially her exposure out here is so large and the demand for like art, like just vinyl collectors and people who would just love to have her music on vinyl, we decided that it'd be in our best interest to definitely go ahead for all of us to, you know, put it out there on wax, a physical copy with a nice pick cover where people can actually enjoy it and put it on a record player and listen to it and, you know, relax. And but rather than just having a CD and putting it in your car and listening to it when you drive, you know, you could take it, you could play it out of the club. You can, you know, it's for, it's, it's for everyone and everything. So we're definitely trying to keep, keep that too. Cause not a lot of new artists put out vinyl anymore. So it's cool that she's got enough people who want her sound even on wax to yeah. go ahead and do that. So we're really looking forward to that. Yeah. That's really hip hop and we can feel the DJs picking like yeah, 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 you know? I mean like that that I mean I'm a huge vinyl collector so for for her to be putting the album out on vinyl is it's a very big thing to myself as well because I mean it's just it's it's another thing like I said it's just that that physical copy that no everybody loves vinyl everybody loves it. even if you you mix digitally you always will collect a record so you know that's that's the cool thing about having that that medium you know so. <laughs> Oh yeah It's from the art and it's finally here And this is how it all started So just Listen closely While I paint a picture Yo, come on, let's do this I take a dose of this fly shit Kiss me up and stop in the build a real I had a swag with improvement I'm choosing the way you live The way you spit and how I see it I'm